Hi everybody. Um, I think the light's good enough here. <clears throat> good morning and welcome to my channel. It's Crafty Jackie here. And I'm in my camper. I have a little haul from Sunday from the Dollar Tree. Um, I have a bunch of videos to make, so uh, I'm going to get started right away with this one. Uh, I bought toilet paper and uh, normally I don't go on and on about toilet paper, but I actually like that toilet paper. We can't use like real, uh, like Charmin and stuff at the camper because it, I, I'm always worried it's not going to break down as good. And this stuff's real good. It's thick, but it's not real gooped up with stuff. And so it works real good at the camper. Um, I bought a pack of, sorry about the glare here, of these pastel index cards because I'm going to have a party out here to celebrate our wedding in August and uh, I thought I just would invite everybody to write the invitations like on these cards and just pass them out to people. We're very formal here. Um, I bought a bag of these dark chocolate non pareils or however you say it. Um, this is my daughter's favorite candy and I'm going to my daughter Becky and it's her birthday on uh Sunday, I believe. Saturday. And so I will give her this with whatever else I'm giving her for her birthday. Um, I bought these for Ron to take to work this week. However, they're still sitting in the bag. Uh, he, it, With it being so hot and everything, I thought the salt on the crackers and the peanut butter would give him a little lift. The old Lance cheesy crackers with the peanut butter. I love those things myself. Um, hey. Bought some sugar-free hard candies to have on my purse and stuff. This one is um, assorted fruit colors, lemon, lime, tangerine, watermelon, and mint. Ooh. And that one's that one. And this one's tropical fruit. It is pina colada, yum, peach mango, passion fruit, and strawberry kiwi. And... That was one bag. I had to turn the air off so it would be too noisy. So it's a little warm in here. Uh, I bought a jar of the awesome orange. Uh, I'm going to use it out here and then I'll take the rest home. I need to wash all my curtains out here. I got a lot of light colored ones. Believe it or not, they already have all the planners out and stuff. I bought this just in case I don't get a, a different planner this year because this is what I've used or for next year, but this is what I got. Uh, this is what I've been using for this year, and it's worked just fine. So it depends on if I find another one that I like better. Uh, I had to buy another pack of pencils, the mechanical ones. I bought some for my grandkids, and one of them was broken, so I just got another one and figured I'll trade it out or whatever. Um, finally, I found some of the Dr. Marvy stuff. But this was the only thing I found was the flash dry, which is kind of nice to have this time of year, especially if you're trying to dash off somewhere. Um, I have never tried it. I did try a, another brand that was at the Dollar Tree and it was terrible, but my experience with these types of products in the past has always been good. So I'm hoping Dr. Marvy really, really cinches it. Um, I bought this because sometimes my hair gets real dry out here and I thought every, I would use this every once in a while. I've been using the um, tree mint shampoo and conditioner and they do a pretty good job but there's just some days my hair feels kind of dry and so maybe I'll use that like every other time. I found some more of the Suave Replenishing Spray Lotions. I love this stuff. It's not great for deep moisturizing. It really isn't. But Boy, when I just get back from the pool, I just put some on and it smells so good. Um, or if I, I'm just getting dressed in the morning, I put it on. This is the sea mineral infusion. And it, I'm telling you, it just smells so good. And then they had this time the bottles of the sea mineral lotion. And um, I mean, I bought Suave Lotion before, so I know. Yeah, it's real. It's very thick, so that's kind of cool 
I'm reading the bottle as I'm it's a 10 ounce bottle so for a dollar can't beat that I mean when you're getting name brand stuff you know that it's uh, suave stuff usually uh, unless it's on a great sale is never a dollar so uh, I finally found some of the little mini pens. I always seem to miss out when I have them. And I bought these darker colors because these, you know, really could be useful. That's bag number two. Seems like I didn't get a lot, but I really did. It just was a lot of weird stuff. Uh, no washi. And there's stickers. Uh, this is the Dollar Tree by my church. Or not in the t same city as my church. Um, the stickers didn't look like they had put even one new sticker out since last week. So maybe this week and I'll go to a different one because I was real disappointed. Um, I got another bag of candy and this is chocolate mints. These all have uh, 2.75 ounces in them. So there's quite a bit, you know. And I did get lucky, though, and oddly enough, find uh, a lot of medicine. And with it coming on to fall, much as I don't want to think about it, but I mean the next couple months, everybody will probably be getting sick when school starts. That never fails. So um, I bought another one of these Quil uh, day quills, clear quills, for my uh, sinus headaches. Uh, I have one at home, but I bought one of these for that. Um, I got the Theraflu Daytime Severe Cold and Cough. And there is six packets in there, berry infused with menthol and green tea flavors. And uh, so that's a good thing to have. And then I got the Theraflu Flu and Sore Throat, and this is apple cinnamon flavor. Man, back in the day, I used to get something called, it was lemon, which I don't mind lemon either, but that's this one. It's also six packets. And then I got the nighttime multi-symptom severe cold with the green tea and citrus flavors, six packets. And then I was uh, slightly disappointed that they didn't have nighttime, but they did have the daytime severe cough and cold berry flavored liquid because this is the kind of stuff that Ron likes to use as the liquids. Why? I'll never know. But he could try that. He could use that in the daytime if he's sick. Um, I got one of these mm -hmm. uses these and she wanted them I got her two of them and I have a coke in here I noticed I got um I think that's all the bags um this was I laid it out of the bag this is uh, a calendar I got this one to put in my fridge because it's got the little hangy thing there and I couldn't find one like that last year so kind of long though that's the only thing I don't like about it but it's all right I'll just rearrange my refrigerator crap and I bought one of these um, we call them zippets uh, I have a crap load of them at home because Ron went out and bought he never can buy just one of anything he went out and bought all kinds at home and uh, for and I forgot to bring one I was gonna bring one and I've never I've had this this trailer for 10 years and I've never had a drain get kind of slow but I have the bathroom one running slow so got me a zip zip so that is all I have from the Dollar Tree um, it has finally slightly cooled off here but the humidity is lower so um, the water in the pool yesterday was absolutely 
gorgeous. So I am getting some stuff done around here and then I'm going to go hang out the pool for a while. And uh, I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you in my next video. I do have a couple of pocket letters to show and uh, I probably have more at home which I will have to snatch up when I go home and do them videos and then at some point pick the winner because things are coming in slow and um, also I still have to send out Sylvia your prize half of it's here half of it's at home I am going to take the half that's here home get it all packaged up and mail you that prize dear have not forgotten and I love you guys I I just absolutely love all of you and I love your support and uh, it's it's just cool hearing from everybody and stuff so you guys have a great day stay cool if you're hot uh, I know some of you guys like uh, Tracy B out there in Utah it's in the 90s all the time so you guys in Texas stay cool down in North Carolina and Florida and all that places stay cool and uh, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.